गुड मॉर्निंग एवरीबडी आई होप एवरीबडी विल बी फाइन एट योर होम एंड विल बी स्टडिंग वेल टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू चैप्टर थ्री सब्ट्रैक्शन विच इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट चैप्टर ऑफ द बुक सो वी आर गोइंग गोइंग टू कवर सम टॉपिक्स डेफिनेशन ऑफ सब्ट्रैक्शन प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ सब्ट्रैक्शन सब्ट्रैक्शन विद और विदाउट रीग्रुपिंग सब्ट्रैक्शन बाय ब्रेकिंग डाउन द बिगर नंबर एस्टिमेटिंग द डिफरेंस सॉल्विंग स्टोरी सम्स कंबाइनिंग एडिशन एंड सब्ट्रैक्शन सब्ट्रैक्शन मीन्स टेकिंग अवे समथिंग फ्रॉम अ ग्रुप और अ नंबर ऑफ थिंग्स Here we have subtraction number sentence. The greater number is minuend, and the number which we are going to subtract from the minuend is called subtrend, and the answer is called difference. Now the properties of subtraction. The first property is ordering property. Unlike addition, we cannot change the order of numbers because we always subtract smaller number from greater number. Like, see the first number, four thousand three hundred sixty-four. It is minuend. Two thousand one hundred thirty-two subtrend, and the answer is called difference. So difference is two thousand two hundred thirty-two. But student, if i interchange the position of minuend and subtrend then subtraction is not possible because we cannot subtract bigger number from the smaller number another property is subtracting zero so when we subtract a zero from any number the difference is number itself another property is subtracting the number from itself so if we subtract a number from itself the difference is zero only so whenever minuend and subtrend both are same answer is zero now subtraction with or without regrouping without regrouping means without borrow look at The numbers six thousand seven hundred forty-three, and the subtrend is two thousand five hundred thirty-one. See, the digits of minuend are more than the digits of subtrend, so there is no need of taking borrow. So the answer is four thousand two hundred twelve. Remember, students always start subtracting the numbers from ones place. Another one is. subtraction with regrouping see the minuend 8375 and the subtrend is 4156 look at the digit of ones place it is 5 and the look at the digit of ones place in subtrend the digit is 6 so 5 is less than 6 we cannot subtract 5 from 6 so we need to take borrow from the digit of tens place so 7 will give the borrow to the digit of ones place it will become 15 15 minus 6 9 and now 7 will come 6 6 is more than 5 so we can subtract 6 minus 5 1 see the digit of hundred place 3 minus 1 2 see the digit of thousand place Eight minus four, four. So the difference is four thousand two hundred nineteen. Students, you have to be very very careful when you do subtraction with regrouping. Next is subtract by breaking down the bigger number. Breaking numbers help us to subtract mentally. Let's take one example: four hundred fifty minus five. Here we will break four hundred fifty into four hundred plus fifty. Now we will subtract the underlined number. Four hundred plus forty-five. 
एट बोथ द नंबर्स आंसर विल बी फोर हंड्रेड फोर्टी फाइव लेट्स टेक वन मोर एग्जाम्पल थ्री थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी फोर माइनस फाइव हंड्रेड हेयर वी विल ब्रेक थ्री थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी फोर बिकॉज इट्स अ बिग नंबर सो वी विल स्प्लेट इट इन टू थ्री थाउजेंड प्लस सेवन हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी फोर Now we will subtract the underlying numbers. Answer will be three thousand plus two hundred twenty-four. Now add both the numbers, and here we will get the final answer. That is three thousand two hundred twenty-four. Students, our next topic is finding actual and estimated difference. I am going to round off to nearest thousand. I am taking example from the exercise three point five question three a, and my question is five thousand four hundred ninety nine minus four thousand one. First, we will write down the numbers in column, then we will subtract. So I have subtracted. The answer is one thousand four hundred ninety eight. Now I am going to estimate the answer. For this, I will round off. Five thousand four hundred ninety nine to five thousand. It is rounded up to the nearest thousand, and four thousand one will become four thousand. Now I'll subtract both the numbers. Answer is one thousand. So the students, one thousand four hundred ninety eight is actual difference, and one thousand is estimated difference. Student. we have done this topic in the last chapter as finding actual and estimated sum so i am not going to explain very much here our next topic is story sums we have some keywords left difference borrow minus remaining fewer which can help you in finding out the story sum we have some steps we need to follow them read and understand what do you need to find out for this you have to read the story sum very well step 2 find the information given in the problem this will help you in making statements step 3 decide the operation to be used means you need to find out whether you have to do addition subtraction multiplication or division and finally solve the problem for this i am taking one question from the exercise only the question is jyoti baked 2380 cookies in september she baked 565 fewer cookies in october how many cookies did she bake in october for this very first write down the solution read the word problem at least two times see the number and read the uh, words around the number like see the first number 2380 what is written around this number baked cookies in september so the very first statement will be number of cookies baked in september is equal to 2380 now see the second number 565 see the words written around this baked fewer cookies in october so this will be our second statement fewer cookies baked in october 565 now we need to find out the number of cookies baked in october this will be our third statement now we will minus the answer is 1815 now we will write down the final answer and final answer we will take from the last line of the story sum so she baked 1815 cookies in october this is how we have to do the story sum the next is combining addition and subtraction again i am taking one example from the exercise this is the question we have to follow some rules here always arrange the number with plus sign together and add first 
so our first step is at 3214 and 1212 means we are going to plus first here is the answer 4426 but this is not the final answer now see the third number third number is with minus sign so we are going to minus 2313 from 4426 now we will get the answer 2113 this is our final answer students this is all about this chapter i hope you understood well do it try it till then bye bye